What is up, people? Welcome back to another episode of FTV Infinity Light. I hope everybody's doing all right. I'm doing amazing. And I know, I know in the last episode I said I was going to be with BC, but turns out he didn't show up. So <laughs> I'm actually going to go kill the dragon by myself. You know, because why not? Oh, maybe I should, you know, show you a little update of uh, the, the new place. You know, I've got this one for the... the the monument, this one for the new place. Let's go take a look. So I've started to work a little bit on it. Uh, this floor is not going to be all like this. I want to make like glass stairs going to the middle. So it's going to be like this. Uh, in the middle, there's going to be a floor at this level. So we can have one, one high to place cables. And I'm really in love with that logo. <laughs> I'm really in love with it. I don't know how it started to work, but it just grows on me. Uh, this thing, I'm not sure. I just thought about something that might be a little bit better than doing some stuff like that. Instead, what co we could do is have just different platforms a little bit all over around, like one for Blood Magic, uh, one for Britannia, one for Farming, one for uh, Mob Farms, or I don't know, something like that. And you would have all different looks. So. I don't get me wrong, I love what I did here, like, it's it's different, uh, but I don't think it works, because if I want to do Blood Magic, I need, like, an area that's minimum of 25 by 25, which won't work, so I would need to make another platform anyway. So I do think uh, we're going to remove the side platforms to the main platform in the middle, and instead, we're simply going to make more platform and not necessarily centered, like just a little bit on the side floating around, like lower, higher, and stuff like that. And I think this, this is going to look a little bit better. Uh, I, I am lagging a little bit. Uh, I have no idea why. Earlier, I was removing torches at 12 FPS. Uh, but, but I guess it's okay. So let's go back home and I'm going to show you a couple of things that I've done. Uh, I've made this thing here, which is a white bag. Uh, and I've simply added some upgrades to it to make it tier 3, and I did that to make it soul bound. So, no, not, not bad. Uh, also, I found a villager that had pollen for this tree. The hype tree, which is the wood I'm using, so it's perfect. Instead of trading with the villager that we have at the bottom of there, we can simply plant the tree and just chop it down and get the wood. So I've been doing that a little bit also. Uh, I've also made the electric bow because I'm thinking like, you know, we're going to kill dragon. Maybe we should have a bow. Uh, but this isn't the first weapon that we're actually going to use against the dragon. I want to try something that I've never used and it's going to be here with the smell tree. And it is the, uh, the shuriken. So, I, I want to try something first, which is with paper. I, I, I keep forgetting that I can just open this. Uh, so, I need some paper. And what we're going to do is we're going to try to make a blade out of paper and just see how... Uh, what, what happens to this? Uh, oh, come on! Really? Really? You son of a... Uh, okay, before I go crazy with that sound. Let's grab the other. Man, seriously, why is this happening? Part builder, uh, this way. Go away, go away. Okay, we're, go we're gonna sleep first. Uh, l let's go next to BC's place. I can't sleep here because it's BC's place. Hey, right, we're gonna go on my roof. But that's the safest place of all. I can't tell you how many times I just slept on top of my roof, gazing at the stars, and you know, that, that kind of things. Oh man, I'm really, I'm really pissed off. Why? Why did this happen? Now we're missing so many things. Oh, this is so not good. Okay, right, well, I'm gonna build this back and I'll bring you guys back just after. Because, uh, you know, I don't have things to continue where I wanted to do this stuff. Yeah. Alright guys, I repaired, uh, I think, everything. Uh, so, our Medellium is in here. Uh, the thing I, I think I might do for, just, just in case this doesn't work. But I want to 
tried to get a paper to get one more modifier, but it's gonna reduce the durability, so I'm not sure exactly if it's any good. That's why I want to have both test the difference uh, between uh, both of them. So we're gonna place back that. Uh, I think this might be a little bit too many uh, ports for one little thing. Okay, so let's start pouring these uh, because they take some time to, you know, cool down. That's two. It's gonna be the third one. This one's still cooking. Okay. And what we're gonna do is the shuruken. So, and we're needing one like that. Okay, so let's see how much this thing does. So that's a 6.25 with 65 ammo, which is, isn't the best. 65 ammo, that's not the best. Accuracy 100% modifier 5. That, that is cool though, having 5 modifiers. Uh, so if we put that instead, it's a 7.8 in 83, but we've got... Ish. Hmm. Should I... I could probably make it like this, and if I don't like it, I change one of them with the paper. And we could see how much it gives per quartz. Because one thing I know is I want to put one moss on there so that we regen uh, some of the ammo that we lose. Uh, also, I want to put... Uh, what, what is it? A diamond or an emerald? Depending, it's gonna boost. So... Yeah, so let's try this, okay? We're gonna do that. Put this. Okay, so if we put a diamond, it gives 137. If we put an emerald, it gives 130. So logically, we're gonna put diamond on it, because it gives more. And it's also increasing the damage. Okay. So now we're going to place 64 quartz, increases it, well, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, so one level of sharpness gives uh, 1.22, which I think is more than what we were uh, losing by using paper. Uh, let's take a look, so 1.22. If we place that there, this one is 8.5. No, we lose a lot more. Okay, so we're gonna, not going to use the paper. So we're going to do one modifier of this. So it's going to be a 9.7. Oh, but wait. It's true, we get two modifiers. Two modifiers, not one. We get two. There's currently... So that could be worth it. But we lose 20 in durability also. This is hard. This is hard. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, I think we're gonna go just Manelian, yeah. I think it's gonna be easier to follow and just go ahead like this. So this thing is pretty cool. You can throw it and... Oh wow, that noise is amazing. Uh, over here, if I take my shear... I should be able to take some moss and make a ball of moss to put on there. Alright, so ball of moss, I think it's called. That one here. Oh, you need to... Whoa. Okay. Uh, cobblestone, then? Do you have any cobble? Oh, yeah, we do. So, for... Or in one, then you remove this, and there we go, we've got a beautiful ball of moss. This should give us back some of those, uh, some of those shuriken that we lose over time. And it doesn't allow me to place that. Oh, assumes by rendering chill with converting to mending moss. Wait, did I not? Read this. Okay, let, let's see. Uh, modifiers. Ah. Uh, oh, it's mending moss. Oh. Okay. I can do that. I can do that easily. It's going to be nice. We just put some levels in, uh, in it and it's going to give us all the things in the world for it. Uh, okay, so we need a bookshelf. Do I have a bookshelf? 
No, but I have the books, which are nice. There we go. Some books and some uh, planks. Like I said. And we'll take one of you. I do hope you mix. And it doesn't because it's a freaking birch bookshelf. Oh, I hate this. I seriously hate it. Give me back my books. Blank. Uh, we'll use you then. Eh, let's just do it here. It's gonna be easier. Where are the planks? Here we go. We've got a real bookshelf now. That's... I thought... Okay, right click a bookshelf with this to convert. Okay. There we go. Mending moss. That's going to be great. If we can use those shurikens to uh, kill the dragon, it's going to be a lot better. There we go. Mending moss. Currently, we don't have any XP stored in there, but if we go in here. And make sure that we're on XP mode. So you'll see that it's uh, it's not showing, but there's uh, XP in there. That's for sure. <laughs> it's really not showing. That's like really bad. Should show. But yeah, I'm gonna spend here a couple of times. Uh, I'm also gonna find the end uh, portal just off camera because it's gonna take me a little bit of time. I've already got some eyes of Ender. And I'll bring you guys back when I'm at the portal over there. Alright guys, so I made it here. Uh, let's, let's just, nah, let's bring it with us just in case we need. Uh, there's a bunch of monsters everywhere. I'm getting attacked by a silverfish. I'm leaving it there just in case somebody like wants to do something with it. Uh, I don't know what they would, but uh, let's do that portal. It wasn't too far, it was I think a thousand blocks off where I was. But uh, yeah, it's okay. So I closed my, uh, I turned off this coin of fortune just simply because I don't remember if you need to throw the glass bottle when he comes down to grab the breath. Or if you just right click. So I'm gonna have to check both. But let's go in there. I do hope I'm not gonna, you know, completely uh, get obliterated or something. Oops. Uh, I don't know what happened there. Okay, so the dragon probably saw me already. Cool. Oh, I don't know what those are. They look cool. Uh, okay, so we've got to go and break these cages. Like so. It's good. He's getting attacked by Endermans. Okay, so look, I'm going to keep these for uh, for the dragon. We're, we're going to use the bow to... Uh, to break these crystals. I see you, don't come over here. Oh, if you didn't know that, you can you can trick the dragon into coming towards a crystal. And then when he's close, boom, you explode it and he takes damage. It's the same trick as the bed that uh, you you kind of sleep into it and like he, he gets close to it and like he takes a lot of damage. <laughs> He's like, I haven't attacked the dragon yet, and look at his life. <laughs> Alright, time for the shuriken. Oh wait, 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 is he gonna do a breath? Okay. <laughs> oh, he's not even getting attacked by these! Oh, it's because it counts as a... Okay, so there's the breath. Do I just drop the bottles? Or do I right-click with the bottle? Oh, you right-click. <laughs> ah, he, he's loud. Okay, can I just hit you with my sword? Yes, I can. Wow, he's loud. Okay, so I can't seem to hit him, 
Oh, no, I did. <laughs> He's hard to hit. And he's going down, so we take the sword. Wow. <laughs> I don't know if you guys hear, like, how crazy this is. The sound of, that he makes, but... <laughs> I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. Come on, get over here. How are you not dead? <laughs> I'm gonna hit you with a sword to, to, for the final blow. Come on. I still don't know what those are. They look pretty cool. Celestial, yeah, nice. There he goes. Oh, I forgot we've got the... We've got this. Nice. All oh, the XP, man. All right, I'm just gonna wait for the dragon art. I forgot about these. We've got Draconic Evolution, so that's pretty cool. Nice. There we go, we've got the dragon art. Uh, I don't think I've got anything to grab this, so I'm just gonna hit it so it falls somewhere else. Uh, I still need to hit it. Okay, there it is. Uh, I think I could probably make a slab. Go under. Wow, I'm surprised this thing is not one hit. And two. Do this and then break the block. There we go, now we've got the dragon heart. I don't know what we can do with this. Uh, the Celestial Manipulator? Again, no idea what that does. But I'm pretty happy we've got some of those things. Buy them a plenty. Oh. And these things can do nothing. They're they're pretty much just light, I presume. They're pretty cool. I like the I like the, the different glowstone equivalent. Like it's literally just like glowstone. But there is something we want to do also. I've got an ender pearl, perfect. We're gonna go in there and we're going to find ourselves a dragon head. Just because why not? I want I want the dragon head. I want to have that on my wall. Bonk. Alright, so uh, first of all, let's grab some chorus plant. Uh, we're we're gonna grab the heads so we can plant them if we ever want to. I don't know why we would want some cars, but uh, well, you, you never know. There we go. There we go. That, that's kind of the thing I like. It's you can smelt these, and it turns into ender pearls. But soon we'll have an ender pearl farm, and it's not going to be necessary. Okay, so I'm gonna have to go around and find that place again. Uh, I, I'm always the unluckiest guy when I'm trying to find those cities. They, uh, they pretty much never have boats, uh, they uh, don't have anything, and like when I get there, they're already pillaged. But I'm the first guy to kill the dragon on the server, so, you know, I, I have a better chance. Even if I'm thinking that I'm going in the wrong direction, because there doesn't seem to be anything up here. Oh, welcome to my life. It's my life. Okay, no, I'm not gonna start singing that. Come on. Come on. Uh, there really nothing around? At least we can fly, so it's not like the burden of walking all the way around. Uh, I think I'm lagging a little bit the server. Oh, there it is. There's a city, and there's no boat. There is no boat. Hmm. Oh, there he is. Wait, is he invisible? <laughs> he was invisible. So yeah, that's how lucky I am. I keep like seeing those cities without anything. 
I, I heard that they drop diamond and you can make diamond farms out of them. So I might try to do that eventually. But I really want the dragon head. Come on. Show me a boat. Boat, boat, boat. I want a boat. Anything? I right, guess, well, I'm gonna continue searching, I'll bring you guys back when I've got a real city that's not just like a couple of blocks piled on top of each other. Hey guys, I thought I'd bring you guys back because I found this, I found a meteorite. Uh, and it's pretty cool, it has like a lot of ores for uh, Draconic Evolution. Uh, the only thing is like I've got really bad tools. Well, it's just not that fast on Endstone, which is weird because it's super quick on everything else. Uh, but yeah, the, these things have like a lot of those draconic ore, and you can find them, I think, at 5,000, no, not even 500, away from the middle island, which currently is everywhere, uh, because, you know, you can teleport just after killing the dragon. So I don't remember what's in the middle, or is it just obsidian? Seems like it. Uh, this one's a small one, by the way. Uh, some of them are like twice or three times the size of this one, and they have a lot of ores in it. So yeah, I just wanted to do a little cut just to show you. Uh, you can find those in the nether, and they are going to be super useful when you start doing draconic evolution, because at some point you're going to need more draconic ore. And uh, trust me, it takes quite a lot. Well... That wasn't too bad. There's the comet. There's the city. <laughs> so in there, there's a couple of places you can go. Like and normally around here, uh, in some of them, there's uh, some loot that you can grab. So that's pretty cool. And since I can fly, I can just, you know, go in and don't really care about the floating bubbles. Seriously. I'm trying to kill them with the sword, just to, to see if they, they do drop some things. Uh, we'll see. Oh look, you see some loot. Nothing here. Oh, you just teleported. Oh. I'm getting shot from somewhere. Oh, there he is. Here we go. Oh, there's another one right here. There we go. Some chests. And you, you'll get some things. Uh, let's just empty a little bit the inventory. Uh, oh, nice. We've got some ender drones. Uh, there you go. That, that seems empty. I don't need the bow. I'll keep the manual in like this. Ah, so. Uh, so, Ambrosia... Oh, nice! I'm gonna use it, but nice! Okay, so Steadfast, Diamond, Iron stuff that I don't need. I'll take the Grift. Whoa! Take a look at this! There's so many of them! And you're supposed to go here in vanilla. <laughs> That is insane! That is insane! Insane in the brain. Okay, well, what we want is actually here. Are we gonna kill this one? There's another one normally on top. Yeah, I just couldn't see him. Uh, there's also one on top here. Not even! Oh, there was one. But the dragon head. This thing. That's what we want. But at the same time, we're gonna go here. We're gonna come at the bottom. Uh, we're gonna kill the skulker that's just here. And we're gonna grab the wings, you know, because why not? Another mending. Silk tat efficiency. Uh, we're gonna take the iridium just in case we ever want to go into uh, IC2. And here you always have two potions of healing and I don't have one of these, so let's grab it, why not? But yeah. I'm pretty happy that, uh, well, happy and not at the same time. The The thing is that uh, when you go exploring for those comets, those uh, asteroids, those comets, those things that have the ores that you're looking for, you don't want to load all those things because it's going to give you a file that's pretty big and 
you would like want to have this just in a void world that way it doesn't lag the server because you're not loading like a huge amount of areas and you know just, just that is a little bit bad when you're loading everything at the same time just because you're looking for comets so yeah the the new addition like maybe maybe it's uh it's a little bit bad for the search of comets like this so we're gonna have to do that when nobody else is on like today which was nice because we were able to come here grab a dragon head rawr rawr i know i know he's not a tiger but still uh we get the the, the wings if we ever want to play with them uh, we get the dragon killed, that way we can now come here and grab some of those endstone, which was something I needed. Oh, what is that? Anglocyte. Extreme reactor. Anglocyte gives nothing. Uh, I know that he's working on adding stuff to the mod, that's, that's what he told me in my comment section. <laughs> and uh, so I can't wait to see what he does with the, the port from Big Reactor to Extreme Reactor. I'm kind of a fan of that mod, you know, since I've made some program for it. And uh, yeah, so I can't wait to see what he does with it. I'm not even sure I'm going to use those Ender Lilies. But, uh, you know, I'm just taking them. But yeah, guys, that is actually going to be it for today. So I do hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. If you really loved it, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you next time, guys. Bye-bye. And hit an Enderman with that. No, you cannot. Thank you. They didn't even attack me. Oh, weird Endermans.